I'm Alex, I'm the Mac Digi Destin and uh, feeling a little bit nervous, first clip of the day. But we're at MCM Comic Con with Sam, my partner in crime from Cold Bonds. Uh, so we're going to introduce the Digimon. We've got my little snack pack. So we got we had to have Metal Vegemon. Here he is being an absolute geese on the version 5 colour. We've got Green Fella. I'm pretty sure his Evo failed. He should have been Metal Tyradamon by now, but you know, it do be like that. We've got Spooky Ghost Fella, because tis the season. Gotta have him. It's the Greymon from the Digimon Pendulum original. Belfamon Rage Mode X. Pendulum Z, and it's Hotmon, but I've got some big fellas in backup. And. Oh. <laughs> he's carrying it out for the lads. <laughs> uh, and we've got Nannymon on the Digimon 20th. He's here just to keep an eye on us, you know, waiting wait for me to slip up and that. So, yeah, let's do this. Are you buzzing? Absolutely buzzed. He's rocking the Cold Mons merch. I've let the team down. Absolutely. Yeah, I've been one upped. <laughs> I've been well and truly one upped. <laughs> Thoughts thus far? Well, I'm, I'm, we've just eaten, haven't we? So, I'm full. What did you have? Subway. Uh, BM, BMT? BMT. BMT. The bastards didn't have the herb and cheese bread, though, so they or should have really refunded us for that. No sriracha sauce. No sriracha sauce. Yeah, that, that is a review from MCM that the Subway staff are rude. Yeah. So, yeah. they gave me the wrong sauce as well, but, you know, I like everything, so I'm not too bothered. But no Italian herb and cheese, that's unforgivable. Anyway, Digimon. Right, here we go, done some mingling, done some scranning, and it is meet and greet time. Does it? Let's do this. Oh, he fires the flowers, that's sick. Nah, Tetsamon gets a free loss on the season, so it's straight as well. Chaos X versus Bloom Lord. Oh, look at that. Here we go. A couple of big fellas. Oh, no, flower power. Flower power. Can't beat nature. 
but everyone's a winner because I'm about to get a new background, oh. swanky new background. And actually, this is the last I mean, one, so I should get the File Island as well. Oh, nice. Oh, let's have a look. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. So there's version four. I'll spend it Where's that last one? Here it is. Yay! Yay! And you won, <laughs> which means da, 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 you have earned yourself Metal Vegemite. Oh, my oh, God. God. That's, awesome. <laughs> That's so cool. Vegetable cannon. Heart attack from Monte One. Yeah. <laughs> Spreading the love. <laughs> Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? <laughs> yeah, oh, Metal Vegemon. Yeah, Monte no. <laughs> Thing is, Metal Vegemon's got plot armor, hasn't he? <laughs> uh, he does. He does. Ace, but you've still earned yourself your very own. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Great reveal again. <laughs> Oh, it's amazing. Like the main, oh, the main, 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 no, not anymore. Oh. Work, so I had hope. Well, at the moment, yes. But it's oh, man. Well, well, we got a hit in. That's a win for that. Yeah, you got a hit in. Hell Do you have a Mel Vegemite? No, I'm amazing. already losing track as to who's got one. <laughs> Thank you very much, good sir. You're most welcome. Yeah, it's yeah. Show it to the camera. Hey. Oh, I'm moving it back. <laughs> Pendulums don't mess about. No. <laughs> well, well, we're off. It works, it works. Oh, yeah. Come on, Magna 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 Magna. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, that's yeah. grandest. Like oh. Oh, what? 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 No way! No way. Yes! <laughs> partner power! Yeah. Partner power! Yeah. Magna, <laughs> the Magna I'm Eclipse. Impressed. I'm impressed. Yeah. Sick. <laughs> I think Frontier is also like, I think like, very underrated. 
as well. Uh, when I rewatched Tamers, my opinion of it is definitely gotten better. Uh, but I think when I watched it as a kid, I probably was just a bit scared of it. Because it, it was very dark for him. Oh, yeah, and that's it. Very yeah. dark. I really appreciate it now. Uh, but yeah, I have to say, Cross Wars, probably my favourite. I don't love it, but I hate it. No, yeah, it's good, it's good. Oh, what yeah. was your first choice with Digimon? First time you first, first time? time. Uh, right, so. Uh, I used to visit China a lot because that's where my family are from and uh, the stuff we'd watch. So they would buy like loads of like, you know, bootleg DVDs and all this kind of stuff. Like, one thing they would get is Digimon box sets but in Chinese. So Chinese yeah, dub. Like Dude, I got ads! Shout out Hagrid. <laughs> Social, <laughs> Social awareness. Yeah. Um, yes, yeah, so we've got Chinese box sets of Digimon Adventure Zero Two and some of the Asian original. And I was watching them in Chinese with Chinese subtitles. I had no idea what the fuck was going on because I didn't understand a lot of it. That was my first touch, and that's what got me into the toys, the digivices. But it was only in during the pandemic, like so 20, I mean 2021, I think January. That's when I got my first VPN. Wow, it's crazy. And I think it might have been because of your videos. Oh, nice. I, looked, I looked into stuff, and I was like, I want to get back into this. I saw that, I was like, what this was VPN. This is the time I've been only seeing the digivices. Crazy, amazing. Yeah. Thank you, sir. No worries. And now I will proceed to chug this. There we go. I'll tell you, it's banana flavor. Because they decided to go with, I don't know, flavors. Banana cost yellow. <laughs> That's very banana. Add one. Alright, so if anyone wants to get home, I would like to uh, so kick it off with the classic favorite digital. My favorite one is uh, I've got Instead of the Mii vs New Battle, it's Magna Vision. Uh, yeah. The moment I first saw it, I was like, that's, that's my guy. That's what I love. It's fantastic. What's your favourite Digimon feedback or Digivice or both? Um, it varies, really. Like, 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 I, I love my, 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 my Mini a lot. I think I'll put my Mini E3 because that has Magna Vision on it. I mean, that's just perfect. Um, I love Crossfire. So that's always um, very easy going beat pair. I think it's really. Uh, it's a great one to carry with you, just have a partner with you all the time. Uh, I, love, I love DMC, uh, NX, um, I think, uh, and I mean, this is my childhood demon, but again, got a special place in my heart. I think either the, 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 the original or the original Pendulum are probably my, my favourites. Uh, I think I'd probably lean towards Pendulum. I like that interactive with the shaking, um, and I think the crosses are a bit more interesting. Um, so I think, yeah, if I was to pick one of everything else, probably be uh, the original page. Nice. Cool. Um, so, I probably answered this with your favourite Digimon, or the favourite anime of the Digimon anime. Um, well, it's, it's, I think my favourite is probably Tamers, which is like the. Okay. Yeah. You know, the, I think the, the common answer. Um, it's, I think it's just got so, it's got so much to it. Um, but uh, I, I the original series is fantastic. I think I, uh, um, the uh, O2 has a special place in my heart as well because yeah. that was like I was, I, that was when I was really into Digimon and uh, it was really it was all taken off like, massively. Um, and uh, I remember there was I think it was Fox Kids. They had a marathon. The second series okay. over a weekend. What a weekend! Well, I, I had to go to my dad's that weekend. I was like, I'm gonna miss it. They're like they're showing like the first 20 or so episodes, and I'm not gonna miss it. So I got my mum to tape it like a whole weekend. So she basically couldn't watch the TV the whole weekend because she just had to tape Digimon series two. Um, and then I came back, came back, and I just binged it. So yeah, I've got, I've got good memories of that. Uh, it's, it's very uneven. But yeah, it's, 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 I love it. It's good. That's magic. Uh, and then lastly, what was your first touch with Digimon? Uh, I was there from day one of the anime. Same. Out. same. Um, yeah, just like as soon as it came out, I, just, I was big into Pokemon. I was thinking like, a lot of people our age, you know, the like, generation um, is like. But then Digimon came out, and I was like, you know what? I think I actually, I think I actually like this better. In terms of the anime, I think this is just this is just a step up. This is much more interesting to me. Um, and uh, yeah, I got 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 the pets. I, I originally had a V1 as well, so I found photographic proof of recently. Can we put that in the video? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah on screen now. Yeah. <laughs> um, uh, so that, that, that was cool. Um, and uh, yeah, this, this is still with me. Um, and yeah, I, I had like a bunch of the G-Swolving toys and stuff. 
Uh, I was so excited when I first found Toys for Digimon and Woolworths. Like, yeah, it, it, it was great. So, like, day one, as soon as it was here, I was like, there, I've been there ever since. What, what I love about that story is that there's every yeah. chance that me and you were watching it at the same time. Yeah. And then here we are, 25 years later, still absolutely loving it. And yeah. It's like brought us together. And in my opinion, that's real Digi Destiny. Oh, I think it's absolutely it. brilliant. Yeah. yeah. Couldn't agree more. Epic. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Do the honest set. Thank you, sir. I, I love, I love the pen, the pen Z for that. Just like the fact that you just do one yeah. and you're good. Yeah. Justimon v Dan Devimon. Oh, oh, okay. Bad start. Oh. oh. Big now, creepy oh. hand attack. Oh, it's anyone's game, isn't it? It is. It is. It's neck oh, and neck. No. Here we go. This is very well. No! Oh, justice has prevailed. Justice prevailed. <laughs> Buzz in. <laughs> Don't tell me what this. So who we got? Oh, I'm gonna get him on as we stand on. Big boys. Oh, <laughs> Oh, I like the man. Yeah. 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 Recently went to Japan and brought me this little bad boy. Why did you find that? How sick is that? Abby brought it from Japan. Yes. Oh, of course you said to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to open her up for the video. So let's check her out. How classic is that? That is old school ass. Yen, look. Yen, look how cultured I am. <laughs> Here we go. Look at that. That is so sick. I'm keeping that because that's the kind of a guy I am. Look at that. Got a pen. Comes with a pen. Oh what, it's got all the, that is sick. I have no idea what stickers, red alert, we've got yeah, stickers. Such a really nice <laughs> the stickers, <laughs> <laughs> the stickers <laughs> they'll never be stuck anywhere, but. Absolutely. Oh wow, right, look at that. On. That is sick. One a dress book, how old school is that? It's like, <laughs> that's beautiful. My original version three orange died recently, or was trying to die, it was being dead weird. Abby came to the rescue and just fixed her up. So I think it'd be kind of fun to hatch it now. In tribute to old Mr. Abbey. There we go, version three, back from the dead. Absolutely mint. Was it? Buzzing. Oh man, I'm sweaty as fuck. <laughs> There's a gleam. In yeah. There. Look at that reflection. You can see me from space right now. <laughs> so yeah, on the beers now, we've done the meat, it was sick. Any thoughts? Just buzzing. Just ace, innit? Yeah, buzzing and ace. With both. Ace. What's going on, Sam? So we have got a Bandai Warmer 40,000 chibi figure, volume two, apparently. So it's a random hit. Show us a pack who you, who'd you prefer, who's your, who's, your, who's your ideal fella? Oh, so on the back, we've got a Imperial Stormtrooper, Commissar, Blood Angel Space Marine, a Inquisitor Witch Hunter, and a Crimson Fist holding an orc's head in his hand. Sick. So I want the Crimson Fist. Yeah, the, yeah, the Crimson Fist is what, I'm, what I'd prefer. Thank you. Best of luck. Being pulled just like on the, <laughs> on the card packs. Is it gonna be bad, bad, bad? It's the Blood Angel Space Marine. Dees? Buzz it? Yeah, buzz him. Happy with that. Ace. Hey up. 
so I'm back home from the con and squeaky clean, fresh out of the bath. Look at that, looking slick. <laughs> I'm just squeezing this bit in because I'm on very limited time. But I did want to just take the opportunity to say like a massive, massive thank you to everybody that attended the con. I didn't get quite didn't quite get everybody in the video. There were some people I met before and after the meetup that were there as well. But you know, it gets pretty hectic. You can't capture everything you know it's uh it's pretty crazy there but we did our best our absolute best and speaking of capturing another massive thank you to my mate sam for filming it all sam you're an absolute geese so uh i'll take this opportunity to show you some of the stuff that i picked up there and some other relevant stuff that i picked up recently so first up dan digi explosion brought me a few little gifts so first up this ace little red ranger freaking so cool this is an ace little figure no idea about what it, what kind of range it's from obviously it looks like there's six to collect i'm probably just going to keep it in here because i can hang it up next to my little austin st john shrine down here i think that'd be pretty cool also got me this sick lego or is it lego it's not quite lego it is lego but not official lego some other variation of lego but again red ranger with the battle bike Freaking ace. So again, it's going to look sick next to my Tyrannosaurus Dino Zord. And lastly, Dan was kind enough to gift me pre-release Dino Rexmon and pre-release Dino Rexmon because I love me some Dino Rexmon. Any kind of Dino Geezer is ace and this will go awesome in my Dino deck. So yeah, cheers, Dan. You the geese. Next up, obviously, I've shown you in the video, Avi brought me this back from Japan, which is just so freaking cool. So freaking cool. Avi, you're such a legend. And obviously, as I also showed you in the video, Avi fixed my version three. And in honor of Avi, I've ra raised a uh, Kunamon because I know Avi loves bugs. So this is kind of my Avi run. And at the minute, yeah, it's Kunamon. And then I asked Avi who his favorite champion from the version three roster is, and he said Bakumon. So we're aiming for Bakumon again, which is kind of cool. Next, my boy Greymon on the Pendulum original has digivolved into War Greymon. So I was stoked when he naturally evolved into Metal Greymon because natural evolution is not easy to achieve on the Pendulum original. And then last night he actually became War Greymon, which is freaking ace. So yeah, well chuffed with that. I'm definitely going to joe him, him to Omnimon. Uh, to get Omnimon on this device would look amazing. Sick. Uh, next at the Bandai booth, I picked up this. This is the Kenji Watanabe Numamon Edition. And I got this mostly because I wanted to buy something from Bandai to show support, even though everything that they've got is stuff that I've already got because, you know, they get everything late. So, yeah, I got this one because I've got the Metal Greymon and the Numamon version. No way. No, what spooky timing. <laughs> I just said, there we go. He just did your ultra back. Come on. There you go, Avi. What time? That's insane. That is insane. Now, in case you're not familiar with the Digimon Originals, it's not a bang on time period. So I haven't timed this clip. This is insane. So yeah, the Digimon Originals, it's like a variable window of evolution. It's not like bang on 12 hours or whatever. It's variable. So that's insane. That is absolutely insane. There you go, Javi, mate. But anyway, as I was saying, I've got the new one and the Metal Greymon one already, um, and I'm keeping those sealed. But then I bought another Metal Greymon one to kind of play with because it's so freaking cool. So I decided I'll get this from Bandai, so I've got the new one one as well because... There's this ace thing at the back, which actually just slots out. So now I can display this next to my Metal Greymon one, which I will overlay now. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So yeah, I effectively spent 45 quid on this. No, but it also means that I've got this cool Numamon device that I can that I can play with as well. It's freaking beautiful. Look at it. Look at this for an awesome shell. I never thought splat, that's ace. I never expected to get so excited over another Digimon 20th uh, reshell, but this one is just so special. So special. Look at that Numamon. Then at the Bandai booth, they had some weird promotion going on. So all the Anime Heroes Digimon figures were a tenner each. But if you spent over 30 quid on anything, you got one for free. So as you know, I think you can see them up there. I've got the Omnimon one. They're amazing figures, but I ended up spending enough so that I could get a free War Greymon and a free Beelzemon. Now, it's so exciting that I got these for free because like I said, these are genuinely freaking amazing figures. And I think 20 quid as their recommended retail price, I think is freaking ace. It's well worth it because they're such high quality figures. They make great figures, but they also make great toys. They're very resilient, 
very poseable, just awesome, awesome things. But it's kind of sad that they were just giving them away. Like, doesn't doesn't look doesn't look good for Digimon, does it? But either way, one man's trash is another man's treasure, and this is my treasure. So now I've got all three, which is sick. And then Digimon drinks. So obviously you've just seen Ben drinking the Agamon one, but I got one of each, which I'm gonna not try now. I'm gonna do it in a different video. So we've got Agumon, who is banana flavor. We've got Patamon, who is lemon flavor. Gatomon, who is pomegranate. Gabumon, who is blueberry. So of those four, Gabumon's gonna be the tastiest in my opinion, but buzzing to try them all, but not trying them now. Got an idea for these in a different video, so yeah. Next thing I wanna show you, I didn't actually get the con. I got it the day before, but these were available at the con. Um, and I'm glad I got them the day before. So I got Green Ranger Funko Pop. This is the 30th anniversary one. And obviously the Red Ranger Funko Pop. So I got these from Game, they were two for 20 quid. At the con, they were selling these for like 15 quid each. So, you know, I avoided the contacts there, but they were selling them. And these are ace. Obviously, Red Ranger is my man crush. Green Ranger is cool as hell, so absolutely buzzing hey up alex from the future here so one of the main reasons i actually filmed this section not just to show you the haul but one of the main reasons was to show you the metal vegemon card and i just forgot to do it because that's the kind of guy i am so here it is ladies and gentlemen this is the metal vegemon the con exclusive card so yeah i've still got a few more of these so they will be given out kind of randomly and when appropriately the original metal vegemon digibattle ones they're all gone now, so if you've got one, you're sitting on a gold mine. <laughs> so yeah, this is the latest Metal Vegemon one. This is in the Digimon card game style. Uh, this was drawn by Dom, also known as Uchu. You can see it on the side there. And yeah, I just went for some basic effects here. Obviously, it's massively OP, and obviously it's not uh, tournament legal or anything. But yeah, Digivolve Zero from Vegemon. Then he gets Armor Purge. And then if he has Vegemon in his Digivolution cards, he gains Reboot and Jamming. Um, so yeah, <laughs> he is a little bit broken, but he's got to be cool, hasn't he? Uh, nine cost because I'm the knife to Destin, 9,000 DP, same reason. And yeah, kind of cool. Buzzing. And yeah, that's my kind of con haul. Um, it was absolutely amazing. Like I said a minute ago, thank you so much to everyone that showed up. The whole day was freaking ace. And uh, thanks to Sam for joining me on this journey. Vital bracelets kicking off. So yeah, let's wrap this up. Gilmon's crashing the party. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Stay safe, stay ace, keep rocking. Peace.